what, what the mate is talking about. What's up, family? The holding company for all of the business ventures of Donald Trump, your president, announced on Wednesday that it had reached an exit deal for the 46-story luxury hotel that has operated in lower Manhattan since 2010. The deal will allow the company that owns the skyscraper to rebrand it. The Trump Soho, as with many of his other properties, have been facing a lot of problems since Donald Trump's campaign run that has mounted since he's been elected. Now, one such staffer at the hotel identified one such guest as being that guest that really got the ball rolling for mass exodus of high profile clients. That guest, drum roll please, LeBron James of the Cleveland Cavaliers. The Washington Post reported last month that 16 of the 17 NBA teams that had previously stayed at the hotel no longer stays there. They're not doing business with them. And many other companies are not doing business with them. Many other NFL teams are no longer staying at his hotel. He taking a hit all over the place. Now I know why he don't like those NBA teams, those NFL teams, why he's always attacking them. Because they're not doing business with him anymore. He's losing money and his supporters don't have the funds to stay at his hotel. <laughs> Imagine that. They doing all of this Trump, 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 Trump and can't even afford one night at his hotel. How does that sound? How does it make you feel? Really, I mean truthfully. This dude, Donald Trump, is getting what he deserves. All he's been is a divider. All he's done is be offensive to people. And people don't want to stay at his hotel. That's fair enough for me. He's made a point out of being offensive. That's his thing. He just wakes up. He's going to be offensive. The dude is the president of the United States and he wakes up mad every damn day. Just attacking people every day. Little stuff too. Petty stuff. Stuff that, man, if I was the president of the United States, man, I wouldn't even be worried about half the shit that he, this dude would be complaining about. Like, fool, you the president of the United States. What the hell are you mad about? <laughs> It's crazy. It's like he don't know that he won. He's still talking about Barack and Hillary this and NFL and the NBA. Ratings are down. You're losing money. Not good. <laughs> this dude is a first class clown. I agree with all of the people who has decided to take their money to another hotel and do business with people who respect you. That's how you do it. Protest with your dollars. Protesting with your dollars is a lot more effective than blocking the streets. They see the light when the money is affected, since that's the only God that they truly do believe in. This last piece of commentary is for Donald Trump himself. Soho Hotel is no longer. Soho, what you gonna do now? No more talk. What, what the mate is talking about? Yeah. Order,